Digital art is possibly the most crucial piece of our mediated world today. As a film music video director, I work with a lot of artists who need visuals to bring their music and concepts to life. You can have a great song or concept, but if you don't have the visuals and scenery, then people won't understand it to the full ex extent. I believe it has its cons and pros. Cons being that it provides a way for people to use imagery without consent because of the availability. The pros being that when people do get tired, there is enough technology and imagery around to create something completely new. I feel that a huge resurgence of art and creativity in the entertainment industry is happening again with films and pictures alike that truly make you ponder about our creation and existence. I honestly feel like we are in a new high renaissance. We are trying to once again define self-beauty and self-meaning by looking to the heavens and asking the questions that ponder on our minds every day. I believe that certain styles of shooting, concepts, ways of editing, and formats used in the music video industry is used strictly for that, although these barriers are slowly breaking down. My favorite visual artist right now is Kale Gustafsson director, photographer, and creator of Storia de Amor. His style of shooting isn't necessarily better than anyone else's, but the stories he chooses to tell and the way he chooses to tell them really captivate the audience and draw you in in such a short amount of time. And as far as favorite style of visual art, it would actually be a style I developed myself called an art video. It is when you almost create a short film, movie, or music video out of thousands of different clips of art using paint, ink, clouds, fireworks, basically anything at your disposal and bringing them together in a collage of different images to create one beautiful story. Not only through this class, but in my time as a music video director, I have truly learned to appreciate the forefathers of artists before. Not only do I consider what I do to be art, but I understand that incorporating the techniques of others can only help my craft. The boldness and creative way my ancestors questioned and respected the heavens and earth was so beautifully captured through their paintings, sculptures, pottery, and buildings. I hope to one day be known as an influential piece of art history. <laughs>